People are in an uproar because there was a woman named Rosie who her children literally, her daughters actually punched a wall and made holes in the wall. And that's it right there. And pretty much she felt like they should not be disciplined because the guilt alone was enough for her, like them feeling guilty about it. Uh -uh. They actually wrote their mom a letter and said that they were so sorry and that they'd even be willing to pay oh. to fix the damaged <laughs> wall. And they clearly felt some real remorse. guilt and remorse in their spirit, so she felt that that was enough. Well, people came out and spoke against her. They're like, no, ma'am. They're like, you need to discipline your children. Was so it an accident? as the resident mom well, that's here. That's the question, though. One, how many holes was it? Was it just that one big I one? I think it was just that one big one Okay, right one there. big one, and was it an accident? I believe they are saying it was an accident. They're saying, saying it was allegedly. an accident. But they were like, oh, money! <laughs> See, yeah, the sisters were fighting. And yeah. I think in any household, you're not allowed to, you, you shouldn't be fighting, right? And you shouldn't take it to a physical place, right? Obviously. But, but sometimes people play, you know, sometimes sisters or brothers, they kind of like play fight. I don't know. I'm, I feel like I'm a fair parent in the sense that I'm not a pushover. Yeah. But I'm also not too strict. So if this was the first time, and if it was an accident, I do like that they took responsibility for it, wrote yeah. an entire note, and then put their, their, their money, you know, showed me the money that they were gonna <laughs> help me, you know, fix the issue. I would be okay with that. Do now, if you do any... it, if you do it a second time, you're gonna get a different, a different yeah, response. Yeah, they're saying that the, that children need punishment. Do you guys agree with that? I mean, there's so many different forms. I think it depends on what they. But that was drywall, and drywall yeah, is fit. is weak like yeah. that. And I think they were playing. Yeah. No, it is. It's true. Mine is like we need so, to consider yeah, the but material. Still, yeah, but look. Oh, man. It's some strong kids if they gonna hit like a real <laughs> wall and do all that damage. So, and I think they, I think they know that their daddy was about, you know, their daddy's gonna be mad. And we have to think of the age too. How old were they? Do you know? They're like, I think five, eight, eight nine, eight, nine, nine 11. eleven. I now, think this is a are, good learning if, if, opportunity. Well, if you're if you're sixteen Maybe. or seventeen, right. y'all know better. Right. You know right. better. I, eight, nine, and eleven. This you is, you think there shouldn't be any punishment? I for think this? they should learn how to drywall. Yes. 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 yes! That's not bad either. Yes! That's a, that's a lesson in that. That's like yeah. changing a tire. You absolutely need to work. Well, none of them did say that they would help because the dad did it. And evidently, he didn't do a good job. Right. Like, oh, <laughs> I sorry, need you dad. to grow up in an Asian household because the, <laughs> like, we, in my culture, we need the kids to feel the pain you just caused us. Hilarious. If our rule is you break, you buy, you break, you cry. Oh like, my it's God. not. No, I'm serious. I remember breaking this stupid vase, dude. The stupid vase my mom got from Home Goods, right? And she loved it so much because it was the one vase that had like a marble color more than the other ones. Well, I knocked it over because she had it teetering on this dumb shelf. And so it broke. And then she said, you come with me. You go tell the people right now. And I'm like, tell who? She drove me to Home Goods. I had to look at the manager and say, I make it break, please help me. <laughs> I had to do that. I had to tell the person, the sales clerk, I had to go through each of them and hold the broken pieces because my mom wanted to say, you break, you buy, you break, you cry. I had to do it. So I felt it and I never broke anything again in the house, never. <laughs> this is another thing though. You they guys, told, that's they too went easy. And, they went and told her. They could have. That's what I like. I like how you can walk own... past the wall and not know. No, no. One it. time, I broke my mom's best vase. I didn't say nothing about that. Y'all got hella vases in did your house. Did you hide it? I you didn't... turned it to the corner. No, I, I, I was like, I don't know who did that. I don't know who. <laughs> oh no. And I that... was the only one in the house. <laughs> you were like, oh, there's some spirits up your in here. Your mom watches the show. Now she knows. Everybody. Yes. Oh no.